<laughs> yeah. <laughs> I went to the beach. <laughs> I went to the beach. Great, Nicole. That's cool. Yeah. <laughs> okay. How are you doing? How are you? You look good. Good evening, teacher. Hey, hello, good evening, Rolando. How are you? I'm fine. Wonderful. Okay. Xiomara, Xiomara Alejandra, good evening. How are you? And Sandrita. I'm fine, teacher. Hey, wonderful. Go to the beach too? Xiomara? Yes. Yes. Okay, that's wonderful. Nice, fantastic. Okay. And Orlando, did you go to the beach too? You look happy like you went to the beach, huh? Okay. In Roland, in Alexander too. Did you go to the beach, Alexander? No. No, you no, uh, I like river, river and mountain. You went to the river and to a mountain. Wow, that's fantastic. Did you have a good time? Was it nice? No. No le escucho muy bien. Diga. Was it nice? Did you like it? Did you like it? Did you like it? Did you like it? No. no. You didn't like it? No. No. Okay. So, but you went to the river and you went to the mountain. But you didn't like it. So, did you like it? Did you like it? Or you didn't like it? Uh, yes, yes, like okay. yes, I like. Okay, great. Let's begin. Sandrita, good evening. Okay, good evening. It is gentlemen. Good evening, everyone. Today is August 9th. This is the beginners. Two, we're coming, we're just coming from vacation, okay? Orlando Guzman had a wonderful vacation. He went to Paris, okay? He visited the Eiffel Tower, okay? Right, Orlando? Yes. <laughs> of course. In Sarah of course. Nicole, Sarah Nicole went to the beach, okay? And Xiomara too. Okay, that's nice. That's wonderful. Okay, let's begin. Today we're going to be working on frequency adverbs. You remember frequency adverbs are frequency words. These type of words tell us how often we do activities, how often we do certain activities. Like I watch TV every night. Every night is a certain type of frequency word. But the, the ones that we know as frequency adverbs are always, sometimes, never, etc. Those are the ones that are going to be the central part of this class tonight, okay? So in the agenda, we have adverbs of frequency. Dialogue, fish, fish for breakfast. Mm. Okay, reading, eating for good luck, and sports and seasons, okay? Sports and seasons, okay? So that's tonight. And of course, the objectives for tonight is to describe frequency, to describe how often we perform different activities, and also to talk about breakfast, okay? So let's think about uh, two weeks ago, okay? What did we study on, in our, let's say, on our last class or in our last class? What did we study? Do you remember the last topic? We study any answer. <laughs> How many? Excellent. Thank you, Yolanda. Good evening. Yes. 
We study okay. some we work. Yes. Mm -hmm. Exactly. What else? What was something else that we studied? Hey. We talked about Albert of frequency. Excellent. We began with adverbs of frequency. Excellent. Tonight, we're going to continue, we're going to begin by completing the parts of the house. Okay. What's the name of this part? If you remember, we write the name. If you don't remember, problem. We move. Ideas? Santa Claus comes here. Santa Claus comes here, right? Jiminy? No. Yeah. Chimney, excellent. Chimney. Mm -hmm. Chimney. Okay. The window? Almost. Uh -huh. The window, yes. Window. Nuria, hello. Good evening. How are you, Nuria? I'm fine. Wonderful. Welcome on board. Roof. The roof, correct. This is the roof. The dog. The, the brush. Roof, roof, roof was saying the dog a few minutes ago. Okay, very good. And here, what's this? What this? What's this? The, the door. The door. Garage. The door. Garage. Door. Yes, it's a door. And this one, you remember Romeo and Juliet? Romeo and Juliet. A balcony? No. Exactly the balcony. Mm -hmm. Balcony. Balcony. Yes, balcony. And what's this? Garden. Yeah. The garden. In the, garden we have the lawn. Lawn, right? Like that. The lawn. And this? Um, what do we call this? Mailbox. Mailbox. Excellent. Mailbox. Okay. Mailbox. Okay. What's this? Sidewalk. Sidewalk. For of course, sidewalk. Mm -hmm. And this one? The driveway. And this? Garage. 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 Yes. What about this one? Wall. 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 The wall. The wall. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's the wall of the house. Uh -huh. Fantastic. Oops. Yeah. Went all the way down. Okay, here we go. The thing is my mouse, I'll use a different mouse. And uh, with this mouse, no problem. But with my computer mouse, it gives two clicks when it wants, whenever it wants. So that's too bad. All right, let's continue. Wonderful. So let's pronounce them. Let's pronounce them. Chimney, roof, window, balcony, door, lawn, mailbox, sidewalk, driveway, garage, wall, 
and chimney, right? So these are the words, okay? Aha, uh -huh. let me see. What's this one? Chimney. Chimney. Roof. Roof. Window. Window. Balcony. 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 Door. 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 Yes. Down. Down. Mail, 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 Excellent. Nice. I see you happy. Excellent. That's yeah. <laughs> okay. Frequency adverbs. The purpose is to discuss how often we do things. I want you to look here. A hundred percent always. Ninety percent usually. Eighty percent normally or generally. Seventy percent often or frequently, 50% sometimes, 30% occasionally, 10% seldom, 5% hardly ever or rarely, 0% never. Okay. Um, yes. Don't, okay. In these ones, we're not going to be strict. We don't have to be strict with this one. Sometimes people say, ah, sometimes 45%, 40%, 50%. The percentage only is to give you an idea, okay? It's not exact. No, just an idea. It's an approximation, right? It's an approximation. So. Don't worry about it. If someone says, ah, but sometimes it's 70%, you say, it's all right, no problem, right? It's okay. So the idea is to understand though, that this expresses frequency. The ones that never change, always and never. Always and never. Always is 100, 100%, and never is 0%. Then the others change, okay? Someone says 95%, almost always, almost always, okay? So let's see, over here, always, 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 okay? Just to give you an idea, an example of the pronunciation. Okay. See? Always. And for this one, we pronounce it you shua li. But the stress is in, in you. Usually. Usually, no. You. So the stress is in you. Usually. Usually. Normally. Generally, no problem. Frequently, frequently. This is frequent. And for this one, the T, T is silent. So we say often, 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 often. Yeah, some people say often, often, but normally often, often, right? Often. Then sometimes, sometimes. This one, occasionally, A. Occasionally, right? Occasionally. Okay, show, show, occasionally. Chong, na, show. Occasionally, occasionally. Seldom, seldom. Seldom, hardly ever, hardly ever. Rarely, 
Teacher, that one is difficult to pronounce. Maybe. Let's see if we can simplify it. Say like this. Only that put the stress on the E. Say, oops, no, not like this. Okay. Let's see. Rarely, rarely. Okay. And never, never. I never eat pupusas. Hey, don't be a liar. Pupusas are delicious. You eat pupusas every Saturday. So you usually eat pupusas on the weekends, right? Usually. Okay, now the examples. But before, always, usually, normally, generally, often, frequently, sometimes, occasionally, seldom, hardly ever, rarely, never. Okay, examples. I usually visit my mother on weekends. I usually visit my mother on weekends. Okay, frequency words is before the verb. Usually visit, always go, never play, seldom read, never take a shower. Ooh, never take a shower. Okay. Teresa never reads the newspaper. Teresa never reads the newspaper. Okay, Teresa never reads the newspaper. Okay, now let's see, let's do the first exercise. What do we have to do in the exercise? Insert the word in parentheses in the correct place in the sentence. Example, he often listens to the radio. He often listens to the radio. Okay, volunteer for B. Thank you, Rolando. Okay. They sometimes read a book. Fantastic, very good, yes. Okay, C, one volunteer for C. Thank you, Sam. And then you'll learn D. Okay. Yes. Yeah. 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 Peter, Peter never gets angry. Okay, excellent. Yolanda, D. Uh, Tom usually is very friendly. I'm sorry, Yolanda. I played a trick on you. Malia, this teacher, right? Ponko, 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 pon. It's okay. If it's a verb to be, right? If we have the verb to be, we have mm -hmm. the frequency word or frequency adverb is what? After. Is mm -hmm. always, is never, is usually. Okay. Mm -hmm. And with the other verbs, always comes, usually goes. Okay. But with the verb mm -hmm. to be, is always, is never, etc. Mm -hmm. So, which one? Tom, like? is, Tom is usually very friendly. Perfect. Wonderful. Thank you, Yolanita. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Now, Silvia Escobar. Silvia. I, sometime, I, I sometimes take sugar in my coffee. Excellent. Very good. That's nice. Evelyn Ramos. Yes. Okay, Ramon and Frank are often are hungry. Mm -hmm. are, are often hungry. Are often, are, often are often hungry. Hungry. <sighs> hungry. Hungry. Excellent. Wonderful. Hungry. Well, sound very good. Thanks, Evelyn. Very good. Okay, now Ruth. Ruth Karina. My grandmother always goes for a walk in the evening. Yes, my grandmother always goes for a walk in the evening. That's perfect. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Okay. How about age? Volunteer for age. 
Yes, Yolanda, you may do H and Jessica I. Okay, Yolanda H. Me, me teacher. Yes. Uh, uh, H. Yes. Uh, Walter usually helps his father in, in the kitchen. Wonderful, very good, yes. Okay, now Jessica. Uh, they never watch, watch TV in the afternoon. Excellent, very good. They never watch TV in the afternoon. Okay, that's nice. Now for Jay, one volunteer for Jay. Christine never smoke. Perfect, yes. Christine never smokes, okay? Fantastic, wonderful. Okay, this is the first exercise. Insert the frequency word in the correct place of the sentence. Okay, now we're going to do something different. Okay, so first thing, listen. First thing, listen, okay? Listen. Travel very often. Cook lunch every day. Read a book every night. Fly a kite. Watch news programs. Study the lesson. Go dancing on weekends. Practice sports. Play a musical instrument. Do exercise. Go jogging in the morning. Study English every day. Eat breakfast every day. Watch TV every night. Watch videos on YouTube. Chat with friends. Stream music. Take pictures. Go to bed early every night. Write letters. Take phone calls very often or make phone calls very often. Like traveling by bus. Take a nap every afternoon. Do homework very often. Read the newspaper. Eat vegetables. Listen to music every day. Work very hard. Feel tired after work. Sleep like a baby. Have sweet dreams. Have nightmares. Night mares, nightmares, have difficulty falling asleep, sleep with the lights on, sleep with the lights on, have a pet, ride a bicycle, ride a bicycle. Now, exercise, okay, what are you going to do? You have to complete using frequency adverbs and the subject, I, okay? So you say, I sometimes travel, okay, do you say, I sometimes travel very often? Mm, no, right. Here, no frequency word. This is a trick. Teacher, you are tramposo, right? Yes. <laughs> okay, very often is frequency word. No frequency here. I travel very often, enough. Now here, I usually cook every day. Mm, maybe I always cook every day, maybe for emphasis. But I cook every day, is, I cook lunch every day is enough. Okay, so we're going to say like this. Si tiene every day, every day, no frequency at, okay? Or very often or every night. Si no tiene, okay, often I always fly a cat. I usually watch news programs. Okay, if it's on weekends, yes, but cuidado con la palabra every. Every is frequency, okay? I always go dancing on weekends, it's okay, but with every day is preferable, I cook lunch every day. I read a book every night only. But with the others, I usually have sweet dreams. I rarely take pictures. 
I seldom make phone calls, but teacher, we have very often. Ah, okay. I make phone calls very often. Okay, so like that. I repeat, very often, no frequent, no other frequency word. Every day, every night, every week, every month, no other frequency word, okay? So volunteers. Volunteers, what do you have to do, teacher? I, I usually stream music. I never take a nap, okay? But he says every afternoon, I take a nap every afternoon, nothing. Yes, Rolando Guzman, and then Yolandita. Okay, so Rolando first. I always take pictures. Fantastic, wonderful. Yolanda? I usually read the newspaper. Fantastic, Evelyn? Yes, Evelyn, you may begin. I listen to music every day. Fantastic, very good. Nicole? I always chat with my friends. Very good, I always talk with my, or chat with my friends. Okay, Cruz Karina? I always eat vegetables. Very good. Silvia Escobar. I always sleep with the lights on. Okay, wonderful. Very good. Okay, another one. Now you may repeat. Yes, Nicole. I take a nap every afternoon. Okay, very good. Silvita Escobar. I sometimes read the newspaper. Excellent, very good. Rolando Alexander. I usually practice sport. Very good, yes. Marlon Napoleon. I like traveling by bus. Very good, yes. Zulma. I... I usually cook lunch every day. Okay, very good. That's right. I usually cook lunch or I cook lunch every day. Wonderful. Marielos? I always have difficulty falling asleep. Oh, okay. Count sheep. One, two, three, four, et cetera. Fall asleep. Okay. Let's see. Jessica? I usually watch new programs. Oh, excellent. Okay. I usually watch news programs. Very good. Nice. Jennifer? I usually eat vegetables. I usually eat vegetables. 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 Excellent. Very good. Thanks. Nuria? I eat breakfast every day. <laughs> Excellent, very good, that's great. Okay. Sulma again, repetition. <laughs> okay, Nicole. I never read the newspaper. Mm -hmm. Very good. Jessica? Uh, I always, uh, always eat vegetables. Oh, okay. I always eat vegetables or I rarely eat vegetables. Okay. Let's see. Rolando? I never had a pet. Oh, okay. You have never had a pet. 
Okay. Yeah, it's not there, but okay. You say I've never had a pet. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see. We have uh, Alexander. Napoleon. Okay. I usually, I usually read a book every night. Okay, very good. That's great. Uh, Sandrita. I, I never go dancing on weekends. Okay, very good. Sandra Marisol Campos. I never ride a bicycle. Okay, I never ride a bicycle. Very good. I rarely write letters. Okay, I rarely write letters. Okay, excellent. Very good. Nicole? I always do exercise. Okay, very good. Ruth Karina? I usually chat with friends. Okay, wonderful. Let's see who else is here with us. Okay. Okay, we have Rolando, Rolando Guzman. I really watch news programs. Okay, Marlon. I never sleep with the light one. With the light on, uh -huh. with the light on. Uh -huh. Excellent, Napoleon. Okay, I mean Marlon, very good. Okay, Yolanda. Um, I never fly a kite. You never fly a kite, okay. Kite. Very good. Sandrita. I teacher. Mm -hmm. um, I never, I never have nightmares. I never have nightmares. Nightmares. Oh. Excellent, very good, that's great. Okay, let's see who else we have. Okay, Xiomara. I sometimes string music. Jennifer Patricia. I never Right, a bicycle. Bicycle, okay, excellent, very good. Sandra Marisol Campos. I, I usually like traveling by bus. Okay. I usually like traveling by bus. Traveling by bus, okay. By bus. By bus, okay, wonderful. Yes, very good, Sulma. I usually cook lunch every day. Okay, excellent, very good. Uh, let me see, Sandra Carolina Fuentes. I never do exercise. Never do exercise, very good, okay. Nuria. I always have difficulty falling asleep. Aha, uh -huh. count sheep. One day, two day, okay. Let's see, very good. Now, William Dagoberto. I always sleep like a baby. Hey, that, that's nice, very nice. Okay. Jennifer Patricia Martinez. I, I always have a pet. Okay. All right. Have a pet. Okay. You know, that one escaped. Esta se, se coló aquí. 
Um, with have a pet, normally we say, I have a pet. Always? Mm, no. But OK, let's see. I will say like this. Um, why don't we do something so that you don't have problem with this one? Let's cross it out, OK? Let's cross it out from here. Teacher, why? OK. Um, with have, only when you use, use, use have for eating. I always have lunch. I always have uh, coffee. I always have, OK. So, but this is my mistake. Es mi error. <laughs> OK, so can you please choose another one? Can you choose another one? Fuentes is the last name, right? Puedes escoger otro. I normally listen to music every day. Okay, thank you, Marlon. Very good. That's nice. Okay, Sandra Marisol Campos. I usually stream music. Okay, very good. Sandrita? I, I watch videos on, no, pardon. No. Um, usually watch videos on YouTube. Okay, excellent. I always watch videos on YouTube. Very good, that's great. Fantastic, okay. Let's see. Um, Oscar Giovanni. Hello, Oscar Giovanni. Uh, I sometimes eat vegetable. Okay, very good, that's right. Marielos Alejandra Perez. Okay. I never. Yes, go ahead. Yes, go ahead. Continue, Ninita. I never do exercise. Wonderful. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much. William Dagoberto. I sometimes watch new programs. Very good. Now you can do another one. Go ahead. I never go dancing on weekends. Okay, fantastic. Thank you very much. Okay, Paula Yesenia Rodriguez. I can't say everyone. I usually feel tired after work. Sorry, teacher. Are you sick? I'm sick. Ay, pobrecita. Cuánto lo siento. Que se recupere luego. Ay. Ok. Thank you. Ay, tan bonita. Ya conectada, ¿verdad? Ok. Fantastic. That's wonderful. Ok. Wonderful. Ok. Let me see. Jennifer Patricia. I always uh, do homework way often. Hey, okay, excellent. <laughs> Very good. Okay, that's nice. Xiomara? I never do exercise. Okay, very good. Nuria? I never go to bed early every, no, I go to bed early every night. Okay, excellent, very good. Sandra Carolina Fuentes. I always write letters. Okay, excellent. 
Plexi, Zulma. I always work very hard. I always work very hard. Very hard. Excellent. La W se pronuncia como U. Okay. So work, work. I always work very hard. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, Nicole. I hardly ever ride a bicycle. Okay. Excellent. Silvia Escobar. I never play a musical instrument. Oh, okay. That's good. Evelyn Ramos. I never ride a bicycle. You never ride a bicycle. Okay. Ruth. Never. Yes. I usually go jogging in the morning. Okay, wonderful. Very good. That's nice. Oscar Giovanni. William Dagoberto. I do homework very often. Okay, excellent. That's very good. That's nice. Okay. Mirna Mercedes Serrador. Raúl Quintanilla. Um, good night. Good evening. Um, I always watch TV every night. Okay, excellent. Very good. Thanks. Uh, Mirna Guadalupe. I never fly a kite. Okay, excellent. Very good. Wendy Guadalupe. Okay, Stephanie Melendez. I never do exercise. Oh. Okay, ah, the baby. Okay, excellent. Thank you, my friends. Thank you very much. Let's continue. Exercise two, dialogue. Fish for breakfast? Wow, fish for breakfast. Okay. Um, what do you usually have for breakfast? Nicole, what do you usually have for breakfast? Fish for breakfast? No. No, right? What do you usually I, No. I usually eat eggs mm -hmm. and beans mm -hmm. and bread. Sorry, what, what was that? Egg, beans? Bread. Bread, ah, okay. Yeah. Okay. And sometimes I drink coffee. Okay. Yummy, yummy. Very good. That's delicious. Wonderful. Thanks. Rolando, what do you usually have for breakfast? Uh, breakfast eggs, mm -hmm. um, milk. Yes. And coffee. Oh, okay. Eggs? Milk with coffee. Milk with coffee, mm -hmm. it's delicious. Yummy, yummy, very good, that's great. Wonderful. How about you, Evelyn? What do you eat for breakfast? I... I eat for 
ask. Repeat again, please. What do you usually eat for breakfast? Okay, I I usually eat for um fruits. Mm -hmm. For breakfast. Fruit for breakfast. Excellent. That's wonderful. Yes. It's delicious. Okay. That's nice. Yes. yes. I had uh, someone scratching my screen. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Marielos Alejandra Perez. What do you usually have for breakfast? I usually eat pupusas. Pupusas for breakfast. Wow. Que envidia. <laughs> Envy. <laughs> pupusas are delicious. That's very nice. Okay. Very good. Now let's continue, my friends. Let's continue. We have a, a, a dialogue. Listen. Listen and practice. Listen and practice. Okay. Here we go. It says. Okay, this bar covers my vision. Okay, so salunu do this. Okay, we have, this is a conversation between Sarah and Kumiko. It says, let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay, come to my house. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. Really, what do you have? We usually have fish, rice, and soup. Fish for breakfast, that's interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too, and we always have green tea. Well, I never eat fish for breakfast, but I like to try new things. Okay, so fish for breakfast, okay? Kind of weird, right? Okay, I have three volunteers. We have Sarah Nicole is going to be Sarah, right? Okay. And uh, Kumiko is going to be Sylvia, okay? Sylvia is going to be Kumiko, okay? Let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay, come to, okay, come to my house. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. Really? What do you have? We usually have fish, rice, and soap. Fish for breakfast? That's interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too, and we always have green tea. Well, I never eat fish for breakfast, but I like to try new things. Excellent, wonderful, very good, that's nice. Now we have Rolando. Guzman, uh, sorry, Rolando, you're going to be Sara, okay? And Nuria is going to be Kumiko. Uh, let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay, come to my house. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sunday. Really? What do you have? We usually have fish, rice, and soup. Fish for breakfast, that is in interesting. Sometimes we have salad too, and we always have green tea. Well, I never eat fish for breakfast, but I like to try new things. Wonderful, excellent, very good. Let's see if I have, I have other volunteers. Let's see. Marielos. And Ruth, Marielos is going to be Sara. Ruth is going to be Kumiko. Let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay, come to my house. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. Really, what do you have? We usually have fish, rice and soup. 
fish for breakfast? That's interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too, and we always have green tea. Well, I never eat fish for breakfast, but I like to try new things. Excellent, very nice. Thank you very much. Now, Yolanda del Carmen Hernández and Jessica Roxana Contreras Escobar. Let's have, a, let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay, coming to, coming to my house, my family always has a Japanese style, style because on Sunday. Mm -hmm. Really? What do you have? We usually have fish, rice, and the soup. Fish or breakfast? That's interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too, and we always have green tea. Well, I never eat fish for breakfast, but I like to try new things. Excellent. Very good. That's right. Very nice. Okay. Now we have Don Raul Quintanilla and Jennifer Patricia Martinez. ¿Quién va a empezar? Empiezo yo con ella. You begin. Uh -huh. You begin. Go ahead. Okay. Let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay. Come to my house. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sunday. Really? What do you have? We usually have fish, rice, and so. Fish for breakfast was in a that's interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too, and we always have a green, have green tea. Tea. Green tea. Well. I never eat fish for breakfast, but I like to try new things. Excellent. Very good. Thank you very much. Now, Jennifer Patricia Martinez and Evelyn Ramos. Uh, let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay. Come to my house. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. Really? What do you have? We usually have fish, rice, and soup. Fish for breakfast? That's interesting. Interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too, and we always have green tea. Well, well, I never eat fish for breakfast, but I like to try new things. Okay, excellent. Very good. Thank you very much. Now let's continue. We have reading, eating for good luck, eating for good luck. Well, there are some different things for good luck. Teacher, what is luck? Suerte, right? Luck, good luck. Now, some people uh, have, or they say that they have good luck when they have a, a rabbit foot, okay? Others, they say that they have good luck when they have a, a shambok or a four-leaf clover, or other people have a, a deer eye, and when they have a dear eye, they say that they have good luck. Okay, but food for good luck? Well, that's interesting, right? So the purpose is to discuss food for good luck. Okay, 
let's see. I'm going to read the first and then I'll have volunteers read. These are tangerines. So we have some Chinese people eat tangerines. Tangerines are round. Round foods end and begin again like years. Greeks eat vasilopira, bread with a coin inside. Everyone tries to find a coin for luck and money in the new year. It is a Jewish custom to eat apples with honey for a sweet new year. In Spain and some Latin American countries, people eat 12 grapes at midnight in New Year's Eve. One grape for luck, for good luck in each month of the year. On New Year's Day in Japan, people eat mochi, rice cakes, for strength in the new year. Some Americans from Southern states eat black-eyed peas in rice with co collard greens. The black-eyed peas are like, are like coins and the greens are like dollars. Teacher, what are collard greens? Like, um, maybe you remember cauliflower and all of those things, but this is more like uh, the one that we call repollo here. So only that they are smaller. So kind of repollitos, okay, collard greens. Okay. Volunteer for number one. Okay, I have two people, Yolanda, Yolanda the first, okay. Okay. Some Chinese people eat tangerines. Tangerines are round, round food and, and begin again like years. Okay, thank you very much. Now, Don Raul Quintanilla, please, green Greeks. Greeks eat vasilopita. Uh, Excuse me. You can say vasilopita. Vasilopita. Vasilo. Perdón, no lo puedo pronunciar. Vasilopita. Vasilopita. Mm -hmm. Okay. And greens. Sí, ¿verdad? Bread. Ajá, grits. No, grits. Grits. Grits is basilo, basilopita. And bread with a coin inside. Everyone um, tries mm -hmm. to um, find the coin for look and money in the New Year's. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much. That's nice. Very good. Now, Marielos. Jewish and Jessica, Spain. Okay, so the Jewish. It is a Jewish custom to eat apples with honey for a sweet new year. Okay, yes, if you imagine apples with honey, that would be nice, delicious. Okay, very good, thanks. Jessica? In Spain and some Latin America countries, people eat 12 grapes at midnight, 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 midnight. on New Year's every one grape for good luck, look, and it's each month, um, month of, the, of the new year. Of the new year, mm -hmm. that's right. Okay, thank you very much. Imagine at midnight on New Year's Eve. Okay, that's good. Thanks. Okay, do I get any other volunteers? Sandrita, would you like to read about the mochi in Japan? Japan. Okay. On New Year's Day in Japan, people eat mochi, rice, cake for stays in the New Year's. Okay, thank you very much. Okay. Marlon, would you like to read some Americans? Some American from Southern South, eat black. Southern, 
Sounder, Stape, Eat Black Eyed Peas, a right with color greens. Mm -hmm. The Black Eyed Peas are like coin, and the greens are the largest dollar. Are like dollars. Excellent. Very good. Like Thank you very much. The, the greens are like dollars, and the Black Eyed Peas are like coins. Fantastic. Very good. Okay. Now let's see. We're going to have another volunteer for the Chinese. Uh, some Chinese people eat tangerines. Tangerines are round, plant foods, end and begin again, like years. Fantastic. Excellent. Very good. Now, Silvita, Greeks. Greeks eat basilopita bread with a coin inside. Everyone tries to find the coin for luck and money in the new year. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, someone for the Jewish. One volunteer to read the Jewish. Yes, Nuria. Thank you. It is a Jewish custom to eat apple with honey for a sweet new year. Thank you. Thank you very much. And uh, for, for Spain and Latin America, uh, Rolando, Rolando Guzman. In Spain and some Latin American countries, people eat 12 grapes at midnight on New Year's Eve, one grape for good luck in each month of the new year. Excellent, very good, that's great. Thank you. Now for the one in Japan, one volunteer. On New Year days in Japan, people eat mochi rice cakes for a string in the new year. Okay, thank you, Marlon. Thank you very much. Now the last one, some Americans. Me teacher. Yes, please. Uh, some American from so Southern. Southern. States, Southern. Southern. Southern state eat black eye peas and rice with color green. Mm -hmm. The black eye peas are like coins and the greens are like dollars. Perfect, excellent, very good. That's fantastic. Okay, okie dokie. So my dear Nitos, uh, I think I still have, I don't know if, if Silvia Escobar raised a hand right now or she had it up. Okay. Yeah. Yes, did you have the hand up or you just raised it? Um, Teacher, yeah. uh, please uh, pronunciation the Greeks is basilopita. Basilopita or basilopita. Yeah, say basilopita. 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 Thanks, teacher. In Spanish, basilopita is with one T. Okay. Uh, originally, the name is with two P, two T's, but in the book it appears with two T's. Okay. Let's see. Teacher, I I don't understand. Uh, don't understand. What don't you understand? What is what? Uh, estaba... uh, sí, lo que estaba mencionando. No sé si es que tenía que leerlo. No sé. Ah, no, 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 this time, okay. uh, you asked me the question, basilopita or basilopita, okay, it's in Spanish with one, one T, this is, no, I, okay, I don't question, this bread, the tradition is that it has a coin, teacher, what's a coin, una moneda, right, a coin inside, imagine a coin inside the food, mm, uh, you say no, right, Okay, tangerines. These are tangerines? Ah, um, okay, tangerines. Other people call it what? Clementine, okay, the clementine. And over here, we have honey, honey, okay, and grapes. 
honey and grapes, okay? So that is the reading. Now let's do the exercise to conclude. Okay, you have to tell me what the correction is here. Some Chinese people eat tangerines. Tangerines are sweet like years. Sweet? Round. Round, excellent, round. Okay. Uh -huh. Around like years. So I'm going to put the correction here, only smaller. Oh, bigger now, smaller. Because I'm going to be making other corrections. Okay. Some Jewish people eat apples with candy for a sweet new year. With honey. Mm -hmm. With honey, right? Honey. Okay, honey. Honey, honey, yeah, okay, honey. Very good. Now the other one. Greek eat basilopita bread and with beans inside. With coin. With coin. With a coin inside. Uh -huh. With a coin. Okay. In Europe, people eat twelve grapes for good luck in the new year. In Latin America. In Latin America, yes, correct. Okay, so let me see. Teacher, it didn't work, DL didn't work. Okay, now yes, Latin. The names of countries are always with capitals. Okay, in Latin America. Okay. Spain, two. Uh, in Spain too, right? Latin America and Spain. Excellent. Yes, that's true. Number five. The Japanese eat chocolate cake for strength in the new year? Eat mochi. Eat rice cake. Rice cake. Rice cake. Mochi or rice cake. Uh -huh. Yes, similar to when they say Alo is moshi moshi, okay, moshi moshi, hello, okay. So then let's see, number six. Some Americans eat black eyed peas, but black eyed peas are like dollars. Are like dollars? Are like coins. No, are like coins. Oh. Oh. Coins, uh -huh. I like coins, okay. Excellent, very good. So we stop here, okay. We stop here with this and uh, my dear ones, today we talked about food, okay. And we talked about frequency. Tomorrow we're going to continue, okay. We stop here tonight. Thank you very much for attending. God bless you all. Sleep well. Good night. See you tomorrow. Okay. Bye, Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night, everyone. Thank you, teacher. Bye. Good night. Good night, teacher. Bye-bye. Good night. Sleep well. Okay. Take care.